Okay, y'all, I'm out of breath already. This is only the second pair of jeans, you guys. I was eating like hella Twix and Snickers before this, so bear with me. Mami, yo quiero ver, quiero ver por qué te extraño. No me dice nada porque casi ya no hablamos. Ya no hablamos de todas. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Here for new. Today's video is gonna be part two of my jean collection. If you didn't know, yes, this is part two, and a lot of you guys have been requesting it, so I was like, fuck it, let me just get it out for you guys because I'm actually surprised that people wanted this video. I thought it was gonna be more boring and that nobody would want a part two, but part two is gonna be all my light wash jeans and all my mom jeans and my black jeans. So many people were confused as to why I didn't show any dark, I mean, any light wash jeans on the last video, even though I told you guys that I was too lazy to finish the video on the part one so i'm doing a part two i hope you guys enjoyed today's video and if this is your first time watching me or if you haven't watched part one i'm gonna link it down below so make sure to watch it so i can show you guys all my dark wash jeans and also people were asking me how tall i am and how much i weigh and stuff just so you guys have a clear idea even though i said it in the video i'm gonna say it again in this video i am 4'9 and i weighed about 100 pounds so that's just a clear idea for you guys and a lot of you guys were asking me to link the jeans as well and stuff like that but you guys i cannot find all the links to the jeans some of the jeans i didn't even buy online so it's gonna be really difficult just please try to find it yourself um i try to remember the name especially when it comes to fashion over jeans but realistically i can't remember all of them but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed today's video and if you did don't forget to like comment and subscribe and keep on watching i'm gonna try to be more clear and more specific about the jeans because a lot of people had remaining questions in the last video so I hope this is a better angle and everything i'm sorry about the background and how smushed it is it's a very small room but anyways, these jeans are from Baddyville and they're in a size 1. These jeans are very popular. You've seen them all over Instagram. I personally find these so comfortable. They're stretchy. They're not like real denim, even though they give off that look. And I feel like they just make an outfit really trendy. This is how they look on the back. I mean, they're not the cutest on the back, but they are mom jeans. So they're not supposed to be like super tight on you. I do feel like these are a little loose on me. Not loose, but like I still have a little space. I like them, but I don't really wear them a lot. And I also have another pair that are the exact same jeans. These are in a size one as well, but I got these from Honey Bum. So as you can see, they're like the same jeans. Honestly, you can get these jeans in a lot of different websites. They all sell them about the same price, so it doesn't really matter. I definitely recommend these if mom jeans are your thing. They are highly stood as well, which I know a lot of people love. It's me and this pair of jeans go all the way back. Like seriously, I got these jeans my freshman year, and they were the first jeans that I actually really loved and that I loved the way they fitted me. These are from discovery and they were only twenty dollars no rips no nothing pretty plain pretty basic except the bottom is like a little weird it has like a little slit so it opens up and i don't know i don't really like that i normally either tuck it in or just like i don't know what i do but i normally try to hide it a little bit these make your butt look good they're low rise they're overall a really good fitting jean for me these are in a size one i don't know if i said it three years later they're still going strong even though i used to wear the fuck out of them so, oh my god, y'all, I'm out of breath already. This is only the second pair of jeans. Can I express <gasps> to see? Honestly, I can't even count in my head how many times I have been asked where I got these jeans. What's the name of these jeans, you guys? These jeans are from Fashion Nova. Sadly, I don't remember the name. I don't have the link to this. Seriously, just search up like light wash jeans, light wash ripped jeans. It should come up. Even though these are comfortable, they look cool. They remind me of American Eagle jeans. I don't really wear them just because the wash is like acid wash. For some reason, they don't really look good with many pairs of my, with many pairs of my shoes. With my, many shoes of my pairs. No. What? They don't really look good with some of my shoes, but Air Forces and like Crocs, I guess. So I don't really get to wear these. I guess I just don't know how to style them right. But they're really cute. They're really stretchy, really comfortable. Definitely a good piece to have in your wardrobe if you like to style up things. But these fit right on my ankles, even though I'm 4'9", so I really like that. But they are a little bit loose, so it's not the cutest look. I usually just cuff them a little bit, and they look totally fine with. Sissy, you're gonna be yawning all in the background. <laughs> Dude, it's saying the camera's on. I swear. <laughs> If you're tired, imagine me. You guys, we're filming this at literally like 12.30 a.m. So, you're putting them all in the background. 
<laughs> so they can see who the fuck is holding it behind the fucking screen. So these are the next pair of jeans. They are also from Discovery. They are a size one, but I don't know if you guys could tell they're a little bit loose on the waist. Just because your girl, when your girl was a little bigger, she used to squish into these jeans. So the waist definitely stretched out. The thighs definitely stretched out a little bit, especially at the knees. They don't fit the best anymore, but they're definitely so much more comfortable. Like they were already comfortable, but now they're like so much more comfortable. So I wear these when I'm in a lazy day, you know, they look cute with Crocs. And the bottom is also like super, super big. So I like to cuff these. Um, they definitely fitted like a true size one when I first got them. I also got these my freshman year. Oh my god, if I can insert a picture, I will insert it. But as you can see, three years later, they're still going strong. They don't look too old. Dude, tuck in the fucking tag. You're embarrassing me. <laughs> Y'all, so this is the next pair of jeans, also from Discovery, a size one. As you can see, these are very fitted and stuff, just because I'm actually wearing the correct size. Be a little tight in the waist. These have always been a little tight on the waist like no matter how much weight i lost these were always a little tight i guess this just kind of runs small but they were only 20 dollars again every discovery jean i have were only 20 dollars y'all they don't have deals very often but their shit is cheap so you don't even need deals the wash of these jeans are like a cute little sky blue moment definitely not a pair of jeans to compare with just anything but with things that it does look good they look really good and they make your body look good for some reason but i would get so many compliments when i wear these these are very similar to the last two pair of jeans except these are like very much more like washed these are in a size three so they are a little too big for me uh, sorry just editing emily over here this is the perfect example of there's nothing wrong with your body if your pants don't look good on you it's because they're not the right size they're either too tight or too loose so just get your size and trust me girl your body will look bomb no matter what size no matter what shape get clothing that fits your body that looks good and trust me you will never ever ever be self-conscious again y'all because that used to be me i used to be like oh my god there's so many things wrong with my body y'all but y'all can see the difference between a good fitting pair of jeans and a bad fitting pair of jeans so that's just a little note for some reason they make my body look really weird and for only 20 dollars size three uh, if you guys have not been here a while you guys have not seen these jeans before but i know these jeans are a little crazy a little look too much a little leg action well a whole lot of leg actually but again a jean you can find literally anywhere they're so popular so trendy so many boutiques like honey bum and fashion nova sell them they're definitely not my favorite pair of jeans they are in a size one so they're fitted now so maybe over the summer with a cute little tank top they will look cute definitely don't look cute on the back at all they literally make me look like a pop toy so these are another pair of jeans i don't wear often Literally at all. I think I wore them like twice or three times. I don't really remember. I don't know why. I think it's because the wash is like very interesting and very weird, y'all. I keep buying these jeans that I don't know how to pair. Size 1 from Mandy's. Only $15, you guys. Only $15. I know Mandy's is not like worldwide, but they don't only have it in Chicago. They have it in other places. So maybe figure out if you have a store in your local area. They don't have a website currently, but I think they're working on one. I'm not even gonna cap. I'm not even gonna front. I hate these jeans. These <laughs> jeans are a zero out of 10. They're so high-waisted, like so high-waisted. I can't even express how restricted and like not able to move i feel right now these were sent to me by live fabulously and i'm sure these will look good and like other girls like thicker girls girls that will make them look good these were so hard to put on i kept getting my foot stuck in each hole but i don't know they're just not like my preferable pair of jeans you know but i feel like this is too much rips especially like all the way down that's not cute so these jeans are from discovery again as you can see they're very loose these are a size three so you could tell why they're like super super duper loose. They fitted me like a glove literally last year. I just ran into a picture with them from my Snapchat memory. So that's like very crazy. These were $20 Discovery. Definitely really cute. Make your butt look good. They fit me right to my ankles. So that's like very rare to find. They're not loose or anything. They actually fit pretty good. But like from here up it's when they get really really loose. It's also very trendy. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen this if you own Instagram. If you even scroll on your explore page, I'm sure you have seen these jeans. Definitely one of my favorite pair of mom jeans. I only have a few, but these definitely are like up there because they're so comfortable. They're so cute. These are in a size one and these are from Honeybum. 
but again you can find them literally any place just look for them so look for the best deal y'all don't buy them the first place you see if you guys recognize these jeans y'all know for the real one because y'all watched my latest haul these are from lift fabulously again y'all as you can see they still have the tag and everything i actually really like these now that i look at them but still the wash is not the best i would have wished they were one color wash and not like so crazy they did send these to me for free so i can't really complain they live fabulously is literally like fashion nova but with better customer service and better fashion nova is never gonna sponsor me <laughs> they sent me my package and then i got it the next day Fashion Nova, i'm sorry <laughs> these are from wrong but as you can see they feel a little too big wrong sizes for jeans are fucked up for skirts and everything, I would not recommend wrong way jeans or wrong way bottoms for literally anything, y'all. Um, their clothes is like pretty good, like they're actually really good at making clothes for cheap, but the jeans and everything else is just horrible. The only good thing I can say about these jeans is that they make your bow look good, like sis, look at that. They're really cute, like they actually fit from here, but it's just the waist that's way too big. I mean, if you have a bigger tummy or whatever, you're able to fill it out, then that's great. Like a bigger butt, you know. So I'm not gonna go too in depth into these either because they're also from Romwe. The only thing I would say is that these don't fit that loose on the waist actually, like at all. I would say they actually kind of fit now. They were a little looser last time I tried them out. So, <laughs> anyways, this is how they look on the back. Definitely a lot better. I actually kind of like these jeans. So I'm pretty sure you guys can tell by now I have two pair of these jeans. But these are black. I actually like the black way better. I feel like black just yeah, looks more cute. better and trendy. And they make you look a little thick or whatever. These are a size 1, y'all. But they were really hard to get on. Like, I would actually have to use my sister to get me onto these. I don't know why they're so tight. Maybe it's because of black dye. Maybe I haven't broken them in. I have not worn this one, but I've worn the other ones. Where? To school. Anyways, these are in a size 1 and these are from Live Fabulously again. Y'all are not going to believe me when I say these are extra, extra small. These are from Wrong Way, you guys. They actually don't fit that bad. Okay, well, I only fit bad, but last time I tried them on, they were really, really bad. I actually wore these to school. For when? <laughs> when you pick my outfits. <laughs> I will enter a little video clip if I can, but I wore it with a belt. They were actually really cute. Look at this dude. <laughs> Wait till you see the. <laughs> hey, you fuck with the fit, Oscar? Yes, I do. So you don't think they're too baggy? No, not at all. They're actually really good quality. Like they're actually denim. They're like thick, heavy material. These are again in an extra, extra small. I was hoping for them to fit like so tight. Maybe as skinny jeans because they're extra, extra small. As you can see, they run huge. I freaking love these jeans. I literally wear them so many times. All over Instagram, all over school, but now the school's over. I won't be able to wear them anymore. But anyways, they're just a black pair of jeans, size one. These are from the boutique called Loving Heart Boutique on Instagram. They're really cute, really comfortable, and I always get so many questions on Instagram when I wear them. I already washed these like three times. The color has not faded at all. They're a little bit loose on my ankle. Um, not the cutest look, but I usually like wearing these with Gordons and like tuck it in a little bit so you're not able to tell. <laughs> Why are you looking at them like that? Why are you looking at them like that? You know you like these jeans. You always compliment me when I wear them. So these the next pair of jeans are from Discovery. They only have knee rips as you can see. Well, they have more rips, but you can't really tell. Like they have not expanded or whatever. These are definitely kind of weird because they're a size 3, but they definitely fit like very, very well. They were only $20 at Discovery. They make your booty look good. Like not the best, but like pretty decent. What is this? Oh, <laughs> what is it? Jeans top ready. Aww. I've had these for about two years now. Still very black. Wear them literally very often. So that just goes to tell you guys that Discovery jeans are cheap, but they're quality. Discovery, please sponsor me, yo. I literally spent so much money over there and I've been wearing y'all for, for four years. I'm a loyal customer, sponsor me. I hope I didn't scare y'all looking like this. <laughs> I filmed the intro two days ago because I knew that I was not gonna look cute while filming this video. But I'm actually missing a couple jeans. I'm missing a Fashion Nova jean that's like washed. I went to the picture if I can find one. And I'm also missing another black pair of jeans that you guys literally love and that I get so many questions about. I will also enter a picture of those because I wear them pretty often. I'm pretty sure I'm missing a couple more jeans, but I really can't find them. I really don't know where they are. 
But I hope you guys enjoyed part two. That's my whole jean collection. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get more jeans in the future. I'm probably gonna get rid of the jeans I don't like. I don't know, people are telling me to sell the jeans I don't like on like Poshmark and stuff like that. But it just makes me nervous, y'all, because I heard a lot of bad stories. Like, y'all are telling me it's easy, but then I'm hearing these other stories that are like, it's too hard, it's a, it's a hassle, like, it's not worth it, like, just donate it. So, I don't really know what I'm going to do with the jeans I don't like. So, if you guys have any suggestions, if you guys use Poshmark or any of those things, let me know your personal experience. But anyways, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. And again, I want to let you guys know that this video is not sponsored. It's 100% my opinion. And even if it was sponsored, I will tell you guys the tea or the truth. Comment down below any more collection ideas. I do want to do an updated makeup collection just because I do have a lot more makeup. But I'm going to see if I'm going to do that. Just let me know any more video ideas. I love y'all. And I will catch y'all beautiful faces in my next video.